Hey guys, what's going on? Go to Puppet Air. And that's not the clip episode, but this is Welcome to Minecraft Story Mode. Episode 5, Part 2. Yes, I said Part 2. Doing this in parts again, so let's continue. Now, for each episode, it's going to be 15 minutes long. So get used to it. Last time we did a finally bit. starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers yeah. to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. Yeah, not our fault we're so awesome. I guess so. No matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Ryan! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! Uh oh. I can tell you the rich and famous. Jesus! We never had this many people in the pizza room. Yep! New Order of the Stone is back in town! Yeah. Welcome back! See that? Jesse high fired me! Me! Mm. It actually hurt a little bit. Wow. Shoot the kids. Fight the body. That wasn't a happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault! Look out! Oh, oh, help! Oh, stop your whining! What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you! It's a fire hazard! Your face is an ugly hazard. So what's this weird structure? It's my new house. And also, uh, my gift to the community. Yeah. If anyone's short on lava, this is the place to get more. <laughs> You're welcome. Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own. With loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Shut up. What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure... Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <clears throat> it's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? Ivor obviously put a lot of work into his new house. We need to show it the same respect that we would show a house not dripping with lava. Leave it. So I'm sure we can find a way to work around it, okay? Oh, my lava house. Long live lava! Thanks, Jesse! That's right. Keep walking. Keep walking! Always nice to see a gracious winner. Ha uh, ha! Uh, haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you, Jesse? We just got back from that temple you told us about. The one in the jungle? What? You did? Ha ha ha! Yes! Great to see you again! Let's do lunch! I'll bring the carrots! There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Jeez, okay, take the left to be frustrated. Well, if we're going to keep that thing up, we should at least encase the lava in some glass to make it safer. But, like, not too safe. Come on, help me collect some sand. 
and you can make sure that when we make it into glass, it's the right amount of safe. Okay. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we make sure this art gets the respect it deserves. Nice work today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find Ivor. Wow, this place is really shaping up. some pretty cool stuff in here crazy stuff <laughs> yeah no doubt hey lucas great to see you it's been a while i really missed you guys we missed you too you have so many other treasures boy you've sure been busy oh wow you framed it i'm him yeah how are you doing I still feel guilty about it. Every time I see another pig, all I can think about is how Reuben died because I put him in danger. He didn't die in some accident, Jesse. He sacrificed himself. He was a hero. Yeah, doesn't make me feel any less guilty, though. Mm. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Oh, damn it. Oh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Uh-huh, yeah, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's yeah. an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Aiden's a stupid bully. He doesn't scare me. Yeah, that's what I used to say, too. But he's been freaking me out lately. He got super aggressive. He demanded to know what treasure you were after next. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited, anyway? Check it out. <laughs> wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! You! Yeah! Yeah! What's wrong Jeez. with you? This That's is the greatest find of our time. That speed. <sighs> I can't believe you're actually... I mean, it's got some sort of enchantment on it, but it's just a flint and steel, right? Jesse, that's not just some sort of enchantment. That glow, that enchantment is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. What? Whoa. So, what's the flint and steel do then? Uh, not 100% sure, actually. But I suspect that it's related to the exciting part. You hey. see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means yeah, we're one yeah, we step go. closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. Did you just make that up? No, I found books, mysterious tomes, referencing it on my travels. Mysterious tomes, huh? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow. Old builders? How could you be sure? Learn something new every day. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment, but how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse, and that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. That does seem like a pretty good bet. Yeah. Old builders, ever sources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. You Wait, see. he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. <laughs> I, uh, guess I'll take off. Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. <laughs> Let's get moving.
eventually. This is so exciting! <laughs> Adventure! We did Lucas, show like I know lions. it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but oh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Hey, he's not so bad. Why are you being so hard on him? Uh, maybe you forgot the whole Witherstorm thing? He kind of has a history of being a world-scale pain in the butt. Yeah, These trees are enormous! <laughs> Love it so much! He just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Hey, let's not get all enamored with the architecture now. You've got a treasure to find. Wow, it looks so That'd different be during the day. And nice. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, blonde guy, are you two as excited as I am? Wow. I'm not sure that's possible. What? She means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. That's odd. Let's do it. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Uh, we were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. Good point. Miss Lucas, I decided... No, you know what? No, I'm not talking about anybody. I gotta tell you a little bit. Well, that wasn't there last night. Climb. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. I will I swear it brought me off and it's the last thing you do. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where... Well, it that seems be promising. And ha! It never... Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> Some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular. Ivor, I was just thinking, maybe that treasure... The Eversource. Yeah, that. Maybe those old dudes hid it in a portal. Ha! Hiding something in a portal. I like it. That makes a lot of sense. Here goes nothing. I have to get used to the split to see you don't I? Oof. Stop dropping everything. Thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. That thing is way bigger and more powerful than you could understand, Aiden. Give it back. Says yeah. the person who just got knocked trying to light it. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Lucas, you chat it. I am a master swordsman. Ow. Let's go! Ow. Everything hurts. Everything hurts. Shoot. We've got to follow them. If they get the Eversource, who knows what trouble Should they'll we get Axel Should we go back for Axel and Olivia? There's no time, Jesse. We can't let Aiden get the Eversource first. I don't usually like agreeing with Ivor, but he's got a point. Who knows what kind of trouble Aiden could be causing in there? Ah, uh, damn it. Yeah, I guess you're right. He is his way as well. Keep it locked. And that's totally the end of it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you loved it. Like, subscribe on the video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.